Hello, everyone. So again, too late. Uh, looks like weekends are more busier than the weekdays, but that's okay. Uh, what we are doing is like we just showing up, like showing up and be present. That's what we learned yesterday. But anyway, so for today, I just want to ask, uh, like a lot of us, lot of us like go through rejection. And uh, like you must have heard this word or you must have experienced some kind of rejection. So whenever we think of rejection, maybe like uh, it's somebody saying no to you. No to you means we feel that they're saying no to you, but maybe it is not no to you. It's no to your idea or no to something uh, which is not a personal no, but like somebody like in the restaurant, if uh, the waiter, they're bringing you the sweet, like, you know, uh, after the meal, like a sweet or the soap or something, and you say, no, we are good. So what is the meaning? Like, you're not saying no to that uh, waiter or server. You're just saying no to that particular thing they were offering you. So they should not be like, uh, going back and crying because you said no to uh, whatever they were offering you. So just take it in that way, maybe. Okay. But uh, just think of it like when uh, usually when you're younger, then the rejection doesn't matter because we don't know uh, or we don't attach any meaning to it. So we never get hurt because of that. But like it starts from like maybe like uh, you start applying college, uh, colleges and then you get a rejection from the college you really wanted to go. Then maybe you want to be a member of some teams or clubs or something and then you get rejected. So it could happen in multiple cases like you, know, like you like some boy or some girl, a girlfriend, boyfriend, you get dumped or you get rejected. You're looking for a life partner or a spouse and you get rejected for whatsoever the reason, okay? So it's nothing personal maybe, but maybe the criteria was different or whatever. And then suppose like you're applying the jobs now, okay? Then you get rejected because uh, that is one more thing. The employer maybe like doesn't like you or your skills are not matching or like uh, you want to do something and then your people around you, maybe close people around you, they are almost discouraging you and like you feel like you're getting rejected. Like, you know, like your own people are not accepting you and how the other people will accept you. Or maybe like you start your own business, you do, you start your some part-time hassle or like something where you are selling some product or where you are selling some service or you want to help people or you want to try something like because you have a time and you want to use that time to make some small money or help people or something like that. But then what happens, your own friends, your closest friends, they reject you. They don't even buy your stuff. They don't even sign up on your site. They don't even come and look at your beautiful collection. And then what happens? We feel so down and we feel so rejected. So this cycle goes on and on, okay? So if we are going to do something, then we are going to feel rejection. And if we are going to feel rejection means we are actually doing something, which is a good news. Then doing nothing, at least we are doing something, which is a good news, no? So that's what maybe, that's the way I, I would think. And that's the way I would think that you should think, maybe if you like to think that way. So maximum like people, what they are saying, like whosoever, your close one, your far one, anybody, what they're saying. Oh, they're not interested. Oh, this is too expensive. Oh, they can get a better deal or they can get a better product, or maybe they don't have time to look at it, or they have wasted a lot of money doing the same thing in the past, or they have bought just, they just bought something like that, 
or they may don't uh, i don't need it now oh i'm good now all those kind of thing so <laughs> these are the common ones and then if you are not too much uh, emotional about it and you don't start taking so many different meanings about it then i think then you're good okay because it's going to happen and that's what the common response is you might get it so like there there can be uh, more things to discuss about this topic and this is one of the topic uh, to get trained like you know how to overcome rejection it's a very very important uh, uh, aspect of the growth which stops your growth so very important to learn this so in that case like uh, more details like if i can add more valuable contents like i'll add on coach geeta 360 uh, but right now i want to give you a quick formula how about it you like the quick formula tell me i think so yes you want to know a quick fix how you can overcome the rejection so my quick formula here is like you need to apply a method which is called as kuch bhi kuch bhi yeah yeah hindi word kuch bhi so if somebody is not hindi understand hindi here then you need to find out okay what is kuch bhi kuch bhi means anything okay but the spelling goes that way so when i say kuch bhi is k is for be kind to yourself okay don't be too hard on yourself be kind to yourself you is like you understand the reason why it is happening try to do some analysis so that also will help c is for clarity so get some clarity like what exactly you are doing what actions you should take what exactly you are missing what is the missing link all those or like exactly be clear why you are doing what you are doing so that also could be a very good uh, very good uh, thing to do clarity okay so k u c then what h then h is like you have you hold yourself up like a star champion you don't get depressed you don't get down you just hold yourself up okay so don't be victim like always think in a winner way so that is like holding yourself up b now what is b b is bounce back bounce back fast very fast that is going to help h h is for be hungry be hungry for what success be hungry to achieve what you want so being hungry it's not like being hungry for food being hungry for your goals for whatever you want you want it very very seriously or you really want it kind of a thing you know it's not like a optional thing you really want it and then b h i k u c h kuch b b h i so what is i you initiate tracking system so whenever you are doing something if you can track it 100% there is more chances you can get better result because at least you know where you went wrong than blaming something else you know your numbers so the numbers will speak to you then just blaming somebody else and playing victim and trying to find the excuse like how i was not wrong so if you initiate tracking that will help so that's it for today signing off uh, all of you have a good day and good night here again thank you thank you thank you so much for encouraging me watching my videos subscribing my channel coach geeta 360 talk to you guys soon thank you and signing off